Hello, in this video I'm going to quickly go over the activity on comparing plant and animal cells. And in this activity you're going to be doing a Venn diagram. So once again, you can access this in your class notebook so you can annotate it. Or if you can annotate it in Word, you can download it also. So let's go to our class notebook. And the way you would do that is you would go to your class notebook, click on your name, click on assignments and A24. So here we are, and again here, instead of content library, you'd be clicking on your name, otherwise you will not be able to annotate this. So here is our Venn diagram, and what you have to do is you have to list three characteristics or organelles that plant cells have, but animal cells don't, so you'd list those here. Now the numbers, again, they keep switching on their own, so you just list three things here, doesn't matter which order. Then you're going to list three things that animals have, but plant cells don't. Now here there will not be organelles per se. You might have to look at the shape of the cell or uh, where the nucleus is contained, things like that to get three differences from animal cells to plant. Because plant cells are very similar to animal cells except that they do photosynthesis. They have special structures for that. Then there are a bunch of organelles and characteristics that they have in common. So you're going to list at least five. And the way you do that, if you can't remember, is you go up to your draw function, boom. If this does not appear, it means that you're probably not underneath your name. There's one other possibility, um, so you'd have to contact me if you can't not annotate. Then you click on the text box, and it will open up here or off to the side. And then you'll be able to pull this down and type and tell me the difference. And if it uh, goes too long, you can shorten it by clicking on the double arrows right here. All right? And then you can move it around as long as I can see it. Then what you're going to do is you're going to share that with me. And I've not gone over this for this assignment yet. But you just click on the share button. And then you can copy the link and you can paste that into your submit tab. Um, in Canvas underneath the URL or underneath the website uh, submit tab. If you have any further questions, please contact me, your science teacher.